Hi, my name is Woody Calloway with Native Watercraft, and today I'm gonna to do a little walkthrough on the new Slayer Propel. The Slayer Propel will come in a 13 foot length only, and just like it's sibling the Slayer, it has a lot of the same features, so we'll just go from front to back and start. First off, you'll see we have a hard handle with a padded rest on it. Way comfortable, a lot easier to control, doesn't flop around. As we move back, the first thing you'll notice, just like it's sibling the Slayer, there's an open well. This is really easy to put gear in, access gear on the fly while you're on the water. Cool thing about the scupper plugs that we have now are there's multiple ridges, so you get multiple places for it to seal. So it does have a scupper in the well. It will have an accessory, a, a, a well cover, just like the Slayer. So as you move back from the, uh, the well, you'll notice that there are three different places to easily attach accessories like rod holders, uh, GPSs. Also, just like our Slayer, there is a hatch here that can easily be removed to get to the inside for your battery or your transducer placement. It also comes with a easy attach rail. Moving back, we've got our drive system. Still, it attaches with these two simple clips. Really easy, line up the prop and set it down. Cool thing about this, this new system is, is you'll notice that we have a shorter crank arm. What that does is, is you, it allows you to pedal easier and not extend or not bring your knee up as far as before. So really happy about the new crank arm. As you move back, a lot of rail to easily attach more uh, accessories. Again, rod holders are the main concern where I'm gonna put the rod holders. In the well area, we've got a nice padded area with six scuffers. This boat will come fully scuffered. A major change in our pedal drive system is our seating. In developing of the Slayer Propel, we elevated the seat so that your hip bone and the axle are a lot more in line than, than previous models. And what this gives you is a easy cadence without the uh, necessary leaning back of earlier models. Adjusting the seat on the Slayer Propel is super easy. The seat are mounted on rails in the front, so you just simply loosen and slide the seat forward or backwards, so it's really infinitely adjustable. Again, hard handles on the side uh, with pads. Um, there is some bungee in the back here for Plano boxes, that easy to reach Plano boxes, reach around. An interior hatch, uh, which is really nice, and it comes with this bucket, which is common on all of our boats. Any small items you want to put in the bucket um, can go in here and not get lost. But the real point of the of the having this back here is the ability to reach in and tighten anything you want to mount. Again, rod holders or anything you want. This area is really good for flush mount rod holders and really accessible to reach in and tighten up. As we move back, a nice open trunk with adjustable bungees that go backwards and forwards. This will accept any kind of uh, milk crate type situation, bucket, bait, whatever you want in the open trunk, so it's really nice. The hull of the Slayer Propel is really unique. It does take a little bit of a combination of our Mariner slash Ultimate Series in the quote two tunnel hull. One of the things we really worked on is keeping it quiet. And what that tunnel hull allows is for water to come under the bow of the boat and rise up into the prop. So we, by doing that, we've eliminated a lot of the ca uh, cavitation, uh, particularly when you're really pu pushing hard, wanting to make some distance. That hull shape and that tunnelness in that hull shape really allows that to be very effective. Steering is done with a rudder on the stern. If you want to go left, you simply move it left. If you want to go right, you simply move it right. In the forward position, obviously, you're going straight forward. Slayer Propel is one of the most innovative and most efficient fishing kayaks on the market. Um, easy to control, super stable, 
a lot of glide in the hull, a lot of speed out of the hull, very maneuverable. And with our Propel pedal system, being able to paddle forward and pedal backwards, you can stay in the current. If a breeze is blowing, you can stay toward your target. You can pull fish out uh, by, by simply back pedaling. Again, you can pull away from structure. Um, we're very excited about this boat, and I hope you are too. The Slayer Propel is a hands-free fishing machine that you're gonna enjoy.